Bartenders and restaurant workers are leaving their jobs with no idea when they will be coming back, and their employers are planning to make more cuts as they prepare for another drop in revenue. Our Nicole Ford is live with reaction from some of those workers. Nicole. Well, Kim, at the height of the shutdown, the state's restaurant association says more than 340,000 hospitality workers were furloughed or laid off. Now, the majority of them returned to work when we went back to the green phase, but more than 100 are now headed home tonight to file for unemployment again. It's kind of like a, a nightmare, honestly. Pouring drinks at the bar is how Emma Youngkins pays the bills. But now, with the new Allegheny County order banning alcohol, She's headed back to unemployment. The last time we thought we were going to be closed for two weeks and it was 86 days later, I counted. <laughs> and so this time there's not even a time limit set. So like, okay, maybe it's two weeks, maybe it's another three months, like, and we haven't heard anything. She's not alone. Hundreds of bartenders and servers laid off for the second time in months. Some people didn't follow the rules, so. We all have to suffer. Matt McClellan will still be working at Carmela's in Southside as the chef, but he says paychecks will still suffer because less people will be coming in to dine. My, my wife's in the industry. I'm in the industry. You know, these are, these affect us. You know, these are affecting families and everything else. So we, we hope it is because we, you know, people got to get back to work. As much as we want everyone to be safe, can't be safe if you're homeless too. That's Youngkin's fear as the extra $600 from the stimulus package is set to run out at the end of July. Even with that, I would I'd make more money at my job doing my job, but when that runs out, it's not going to be livable. I mean, unemployment's not supposed to be livable, but with this, it's not my fault that I'm being laid off. Now, the latest unemployment numbers from the state show that nearly 42,000 people filed new claims just last week for a grand total of 2 million new claims since early March. Now, the state's restaurant association says it's just too early to predict how many new claims will be coming out of Allegheny County after tonight. We're reporting live on the North Shore, Nicole Ford, KDKA News.